what is up guys we're gonna be doing an opening here of the force of the breaker special edition opening uh i thought this was really cool to get because uh you get i don't know you get two packs of force of the breaker and you also get one pack of invasion of chaos which is definitely really interesting uh if you guys actually remembered we did an opening for the legendary collection uh, game board edition and that included invasion of chaos we actually pulled invader of darkness which was a really cool pull there but of course we also pulled our ultimate edition 2 as well of dark revelation 3 and i thought it was really interesting getting all these old retro cards so this was really interesting for me to get because um you know, I want some cards for GOAT formats. And also, uh, you get two promos here. So you get Winged Rhinos or Mecha, or not Mecha, but just the original Phantom Beast Rock Lizard. So definitely will be really interesting to open here. Uh, so yeah, let's just get started. Alright, cool. So right off the bat, we can see our promo is uh, Winged Rhinos. Uh, so let's get this opened up. Okay, we can see it's in this uh, packaging here, and all right. So here's our promo, Winged Rhinos. Uh, really retro card for some of you guys here. So let's just focus on this. Uh, when a trap card is activated, you can return this face-up card from the field to its owner's hand. Uh, so definitely really, really cool here. Um, an 1800 Beat Stick Beast Warrior. So searchable by Tanky. Uh, might be very interesting for you guys to actually play here. So yeah. Sorry about the glare there. But um, as you can see, the card's pretty shiny. Uh, so we'll set this aside for now. But we have our three packs here. So uh, we have two packs of these. So let's just open this first and save the Invasion of Chaos for last. All right. So, how can I get this open? It actually opens really differently. Alright, so, backs to the wall. So, 6 Samurai support. A Cell Breeding Device. A Volcanic Hammer. Terrible Deal. A Crystal Beast Topaz Tiger. Alright, nice. So as you can see, in these ones, you're either going to get a rare or a hollow. You won't get a rare and hollow. So, yeah, that's too bad. And of course, you're not going to get a guaranteed super. It's not the new packs as well. Uh, we have Last Resort. A Crystal Beast Amber Mammoth. A Crystal Abundance. That's really cool. And a Hard Selling Goblin. Alright, so nothing particularly major in there, but uh, hopefully we can still have other chances with these. So, let's get this opened. It's actually very difficult to open these packs, by the way. Um, I'm trying to tear it as much as possible, but it's not like the new ones. Even the card quality feels a lot different as well. So, Crystal Beast Ruby Carbuncle. Crystal Promise. Volcanic Scattershot, Crystal Raigeki, oh and nice, we have a super rare Radiant Mirror Force, alright, I don't know why it's not focusing here, so apologies for that, but uh, yeah, definitely really really nice here, and uh, yep, I don't know if you guys can see a bit of glare there, but this is a super rare, so very awesome, alright, nice. Uh, we also have Gem Flash Energy, uh, Breakthrough, a Magnus Slash Dragon, which can be used in Crystal Beasts, and we also have a Blaze Accel Accelerator. So, really awesome cards here that's actually quite specific to certain archetypes. Um, seeing a lot of Six Samurai support, uh, Crystal Beast support, and uh, Volcanic support as well, but of course... That was only two packs of Volcanic uh, of Force of the Breaker here, so now we actually have our Invasion of Chaos. So let's actually see what we get in here. Really excited about this one, so... Alright, so this one opens a little bit more easy. Um, it's upside down, maybe that's a sign that we'll get something really, really good here. Um, yes, so... The whole cards here are all upside down, so let's see. We have Gora, Turtle of Illusion. We have a Jade Insect Whistle, 
Smashing Ground, definitely a viable card in GOAT format. We have a Dez Kangaroo here. And we have Ultra Evolution Peel, so that's not too bad at all. Um, tribute a Reptile Monster on your side of the field and Special Summon a Dinosaur type monster from your hand. We also have Blasting Ruins, uh, definitely a really interesting card for a burn deck. We have Neobug. Uh, Salvage, definitely still a viable card in Mermails. And we have Sylphid, so yeah, that's basically what we got for this uh, particular opening here. I thought this was actually uh, pretty nice, I uh, didn't expect to pull any hollows at all, but uh, the Radiant Mirror Force definitely made up for it. But uh, for a bit of a bonus here for you guys, um, I'm actually thinking, you know what, since you guys stuck out for this long to watch an opening, um, that's, you know, it's going to be a short video, so let's throw in an extra uh, Dark Revelation. 3 Ultimate Edition 2 as well, so got one of these, so let's get it opened up Alright, so if you guys actually remember we last time we got the uh, guide So here it is and we also have our Dragon Master Knight But we've seen that already so it's more so the packs that we want to see what's inside so uh, Let's just get started Oh dear, it's actually pretty hard to open So I'll open it from here Alright, let's see what we get here. So we have Rock from the Valley of the Haze. Skull Dog Marin. We have a Battery Man Double A. A Mind Golem. A Heater, the Fire Charmer. So definitely nice to see these retro cards. And a Pitch Black War Wolf as well as... Nice, a rare Phoenix Wing Wind Blast. Uh, definitely a really nice card here. Uh, not too bad at all, actually. We also have Ninja 2 Art of Decoy. Uh, Ninjas are obviously now very playable, so that's a good card. Cemetery Bomb. Release Restraint. And Ballister of Rampant Smashing, as well as a Refusion. Uh, this card's actually a really nice card. Uh, it's actually going for about Four dollars as a common at the moment as well. So, if you guys can actually get these uh, packs of uh, Dark Revelation three and you're able to pull this, uh, you're actually pretty lucky here. So, let's go with uh, our next pack. All right. So we have Element Soldier and Insect Knight, Arm Dragon Level three, Chusuke the Mouse Fighter. A Woodborg in Parchi, and we have all right, nice. I'll take this. A rare Dark Blade, the Dragon Knight. A uh, very cool card here. We actually have a fusion of Dark Blade and Pitch Dark Dragon. So yeah, hoping I can actually get the materials for this, but looking good. We have a Zing Zen Hu. We have a Level Conversion Lab Taunt. Shifting Shadows, Moki Moki Smackdown, really nice, and a Kaminote Blow. So, overall, not too bad here. Um, you don't realize this, but uh, with Dark Revelation 3, a lot of commons can actually retain their value as well, and uh, can actually go for a high price given that some of them are, or actually all of them, are viable for GOAT format. So, uh, Refusion's definitely one of those cards, and getting a card like Dark Blade the Dragon Knight is definitely not bad at all. Uh, so yeah, this was definitely really, really nice here, as well as the uh, Phoenix Wing Wind Blast, which is definitely also a very viable card. But uh, hopefully you guys actually enjoyed this video. Tell me what you guys think about this. Uh, I will be actually doing a lot more of these, um, I guess, older type pack openings or retro type pack openings. So if you guys want to see more of those, then give this video a like and uh, let me know in the comment section down below. But in the meantime, hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you next time.